Okay, what are we looking at this time? We're looking at the um, the Tate, the modified Tate uh, radio, uh, which is running the Simplex node in Caffelli. In this case, it's MB6IRL. Okay, and the Raspberry Pi on the top. The uh, card you can see put in front of the radio is uh, not intended as an advert. Uh, but you can see the blue light which is very bright uh, shining through the card and it's only there to uh, to stop it clearing out this uh, video okay uh, at this moment in time the Raspberry Pi is not turned on so I'm just going to uh, turn it on one second okay and we'll have a look to see how, uh, how long it takes to start up okay so uh, just one second Okay, it's just turned on there, and we'll know when it's um, fully booted and connected because you should hear the audio from a, a, a handset radio in the background. This particular one is um, configured to boot up and connect to 5 Bravo, I think. Yeah, okay, you can see the, uh, the Wi Fi dongle uh, starting to flash away there and hopefully you now it will be connecting and the only connections here are the power to the Raspberry Pi right and the USB cable that's the black cable on the left by the green flashing dot right there we go yeah okay uh, so it started up it's connected to uh, IRC DDB and it's um, it's connected to the node okay so apart from the DC 12 volts going into the uh, node radio and of course the antenna cable the only other cable is the um, the power cord for the Raspberry Pi which is 5 volts on the right hand side on the left hand side as I said that's the USB connection between the Pi and the node radio okay um, what I intend to do shortly is the Raspberry Pi is powered by 5 volts DC and of course the uh, the Tate radio which is XPMR is powered by 12 volts DC now uh, you wouldn't have to be that clever to put a little 5 volt regulator off the 12 volt supply to the radio feed the Raspberry Pi right uh, and that's it right that's the only thing uh, that's the Pi as we can see it the USB cable and uh, everything is uh, okay there right they knock the card over now so it's sort of glaring out a bit um, right I'll connect to a different reflector now using the uh, using the E92 uh, so I'll connect, it's quite late in the evening, so I'll connect to uh, 5W, right, just to prove it works. You'll see the PTT on the Tate, the red light come on once uh, we start doing, once it connects. Okay, so i got to think how to do this now, it's D523, yeah? Okay, I can't do the PTT, and... Um, I can't do the PTT and the buttons but I'll just uh, blip up and you can see that it's come back and responds yeah okay uh, I'll just put the um, the radio down I'll put the camera down rather and just change the the, uh, the reflector just to show all is working fine you should be able to hear it no problem at all okay so let's have a look it's D five no it's not okay D five two three. Alright, this is a bit of a shambles, but trust me, 
um, it works superbly well. It's on 24-7 when I'm home, of course, because this is an attended node. And um, I don't have to run a PC 24-7. All I have is the, the um, node radio running and the Raspberry Pi. Right. Obviously, most of us have a, a Wi-Fi router connected to our internet. Um, that's the only thing. Um, that's the complete setup. Okay. Again, anybody that uh, is intending to do this, not sure how to do it, um, wants some advice, or even want a pre-configured card, which you'd have to give me the details. All right. As in. Um, what are you going to run? You're going to run a DVAP, you're going to run whatever radio. One of the uh, problems we're having at the moment is using the sound card repeater. And that's only a matter of time before we in interface a standard FM radio directly with a Raspberry Pi. The problem at the moment is there is no audio in on the Raspberry Pi, so we'd have to use a sound dongle. For that there is audio out and we can use that and I I have had one beacon in straight through an FM radio okay hope this helps and uh, if you need any help or advice have a word with Dave have a look on the forum right uh, you can personal message me on the, the forum uh, on GB7 CD of course that is that uh, Dave worked so hard to um, to keep up and running and uh, we can uh, we can correspond through that uh, because any advice I give you individually everybody else uh, can benefit from okay thanks for watching